Okay, fill these birch branches just like this. When the governor and first lady return home Tuesday, okay, so the executive residents will have that holiday feeling. I think they're gonna, uh, they're gonna pull up with a smile on their face. Lakeisha Hamilton never had any interest in decorating or gardening until she got arrested for an assault during a drive-by shooting. I wouldn't, have been, I wouldn't even have been introduced to the idea of thinking that I can grow anything, which includes myself. So it's down to about this part. She and seven other state inmates are on the holiday decorating crew. They're all graduates of Tacoma Community College's horticulture and floriculture program taught within the Washington Correction Center for Women. Fill that in. And Candace Ralston, who's in for theft and forgery, says it's a privilege to be on the crew for a third year now. This is just a way to show that you've grown and that people trust you and that, you know, your integrity is growing and it's just, it's a really special feeling. Feel good about themselves. Building self-esteem is, is something that's huge in our program. Ed Sharp teaches the classes and says this field trip is a highlight of the year. He believes educating women while they're locked up helps prepare them for life after prison. If you're not going to give them a skill and they get out, uh, the same things are going to happen. I feel like learning these things, we give back to the community and to ourselves at the same time. Lakeisha Hamilton already has a job lined up at a community garden when she's released next year. She knows there are some who don't think she deserves schooling or field trips, but for someone who spent 13 years in prison, she says she needs help starting over. I know we all made our mistakes and we made like some poor choices in life, but I like to say this is like one of our howevers. Like I might have made a bad choice one day, but however, I've learned the skills to change. Nice job. Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.